Greetings, I'm Dr. Fizzbot. Have you ever wondered why the moon seems so bright at night? Did you know that the moon doesn't create its own light? Instead, it reflects the light of the sun. The moon looks different depending on its position and the location of the sun. That's how we have so many different phases of the moon. Astronomers, who are scientists that study everything in the universe beyond Earth's atmosphere, even have names for when the moon looks different, including supermoon, blood moon, blue moon, harvest moon, and more. Have you ever seen one of those special moon phases? Hmm. Today, we're going to check out the basic phases of the moon with a yummy methodology, which means process. Here we go. Today at Fizzbop Labs, I'm assisted by Waverly. Let's get started. First, the Fizzlebop supply list. You need one package of chocolate sandwich cookies, some spoons, and the Cookie Moon Phase Guide, which can be found under Fizz Extras on fizzlebop.com. Okay, now that we've gathered our supplies, let's get to the experiment. First, we're going to carefully and slowly twist the two sections of the sandwich cookies in opposite directions. This will increase the amount of frosting on one side. Then, we pull the two sides apart. Here's a fizzlicious fizz tip for you. If your frosting sticks to both sides, you'll need to eat the cookie and try again. Did that say eat? We get to eat the cookies? Yeah, why not? Oh, wonderful. Wonderful. Okay, now that we have one side with the majority of frosting, we'll use the spoon to scoop away frosting according to the cookie moon phase guide. We'll repeat this step for each phase of the moon shown on the guide. Hmm. Okay. Right. <laughs> Next, Ooh. we'll arrange the cookies in the order of the Cookie Moon Phase Guide and observe. Excellent. Here's another fizz tip. If it's nighttime, look outside and see what what face the moon is right now. That's wonderful. Finally, we get to eat our moon phases and enjoy. Very delicious. Hmm. Hmm. I hope you'll snap a picture and post it online so we can see the results of your marvelous experiment. Tag us at Fizzlebop Labs and use hashtag Fizzlebop. Here are some moon fizz facts for you. Did you know the moon moves about 3.8 centimeters, almost 1.5 inches away from the Earth each year? And as of 2021, only 12 humans have walked on the moon. But that's likely to change in the coming years. Maybe you'll be one of those humans. And if you are, you'll feel a lot lighter since the moon's gravity is only one-sixth of the Earth's gravity. And if you do go, be sure to take your copy of Faith and Science with Dr. Fizzbot. And would you please send me a photo of you on the moon with the book? It's time to collect our data. You can record it in your Fizzlebop Labs notebook. What phase is the moon currently in where you live? Which cookie moon? Tasted, tasted best. The full moon, it had the most frosting, of course. I like the new moon. <laughs> moon. 
That's it. Enjoy your cookie moon faces. But first, I hope you'll share them with us by tagging at Fizzbop Labs and using hashtag Fizzbop. Thanks for joining us here at Fizzbop Labs. I hope you had as fantastic and fizzlicious time as I have. Join us here each week for a new experiment. Here are the phases of the moon. Full moon, waning gibbous, last quarter, waning crescent, new moon, waxing crescent, first quarter, and waxing gibbous. Those are the phases of the moon. Oreo, don't eat those! I think that's a cute.